Unbelievable evidence that gold is truly buried within the money pit was uncovered during the final dig of the year, as horrible discovery was made at Oak Island during final excavation. Everyone's attention was still on the money pit and the ongoing B4C shaft excavation. The Oak Island crew kept a tight eye on the excavation, hoping for any major developments that may lead them to the long-lost treasure room or a nearby vault. Only five feet to the north of Borehole C, the B4C shaft is currently around 90 feet down. Recent work in the C1 cluster has yielded some intriguing findings, including what may be remnants of wooden tunnels from the 15th century. Horrible discovery was made at Oak Island during final excavation, and the discovery of these tunnels and funnels has prompted widespread interest in their design, function, and the technological capabilities of ancient people. It has also been theorized that a tunnel leading to a treasure room may exist due to the discovery of abundant metal and gold. When the team discovers a tunnel at 90 feet below ground, they take it as a strong sign that they are getting close to the original money pit. There's always excitement when digging, because you never know what the next grab or scoop might unearth. One of the reasons they think gold was brought to the money pit is because of the gold they found in the water. The team finds a few pieces of wood here and there, but the most notable find thus far is a big iron fastener. The team determines that the massive iron fastener predates the discovery of the money pit because its age is considered to be from the 1800s or even earlier due to its primitive craftsmanship. The discovery of these artifacts adds another layer of historical relevance to the money pit. A hand-forged spike is one of the artifacts that the crew has unearthed, and it has drawn them particular interest. They want to conduct an examination of the spike, which is significant despite the fact that it has a primitive appearance, the presence of hand-forged raw iron, and the evidence that it has aged. It has the potential to give light on the history of Oak Island. However, the group is forced to backtrack when they come into contact with bedrock approximately 130 feet down in the B4C shaft. Because of this obstruction, continuing the digging and exploring will be tough. Due to a lack of available time, the excavations that were being done in the region of the money pit have been halted for the year. The teams trust that the treasure that has been sought after for more than two centuries is still buried somewhere beneath Oak Island has been strengthened by the evidence that has been acquired from five enormous steel holes that have been sunk over the past few months. The crew is well aware that in order to make any significant headway in their search, they will need to make use of cutting-edge technology. This is because the layout of the money pit is quite complicated. Due to the fact that there is scientific data pointing to the presence of considerable amounts of gold and silver below the surface, they have a strong urge to continue digging. With every new hole that is dug and every new discovery that is made, the crew's self-assurance in their capacity to achieve their goals continues to increase. They have not given up hope of recovering the long-lost fortune on Oak Island, and they are prepared to employ whatever means necessary to achieve their goal. The discovery by the team of exactly where in the tunnel they were located was a significant advance in their exploration efforts. Their previous understanding of the location has been significantly bolstered as a result of the discovery of the handcrafted spike. The group is aware that they need to conduct additional research in order to determine where the surge originated and what it indicates. And in order to do so, they intend to make use of techniques such as carbon-14 dating, C-14. After the iron spike was found at a depth of more than 100 feet in the B4C shaft, a meeting was scheduled at the research center to examine the results with key members, Marty Legina, Craig Tester, and Gary Drayton, as well as the blacksmithing expert Carmen Legg. As a result of Carmen's inquiry, our comprehension of the Oak Island enigma has likely been expanded, and new information regarding the spike's past and significance may become available. Carmen has determined that the iron spike that was discovered in the B4C shaft is a rock drill, which is a tool that dates back to the medieval period. It gets even more exciting when Carmen relates this information to certain swages that were identified by the researchers two years ago. It turns out that one use of the swages was to hone the edges of rock drills. For its similarity to drills used in the Middle Ages, the rock drill, which is used for drilling rocks or breaking up enormous boulders, is sometimes considered an important antiquity. Its existence on Oak Island prompts intriguing speculation regarding the history of the money pit and the whereabouts of its hidden treasure. 
Members of the crew wonder if this artifact is additional proof that they are nearing the legendary riches. The rock drill has historical value, since it may be connected to the first construction of the money pit, and by extension, may reveal important details about the materials and techniques used in that initial construction. The excitement around the exploration of the hidden areas on Oak Island has only increased in light of the team's recent discoveries, which include the stone-paved area in the swamp and the ancient stone road. There's a growing sense of intrigue about what might be hiding in the money pit as they eliminate suspects. The Legina brothers express their appreciation for the team's help and affirm their belief in the island's potential for gold. Their dogged persistence has led them to combine traditional methods of excavation with a search for relevant information. Thanks to everyone's hard work and Charles and Billy's leadership, the Oak Island mystery has been solved to an unprecedented degree. A bunch of kids started digging on Oak Island with the best of intentions, but things quickly took a turn for the worse, evoking horror film vibes. By uncovering man-made stones and boards, the treasure hunters hoped they had found a truly remarkable discovery from the days of piracy. As they descended, however, their enthusiasm turned to fear as they discovered more and more boards hiding something sinister underneath them. They tried for a long time but gave up at a depth of 20 feet. However, the narrative does not finish there, as further discoveries lie ahead. At regular intervals of 10 feet, the excavation crew uncovered increasingly creepy artifacts. The increasing uneasiness was due to the constant exposure of new platforms and strange artifacts as one progressed through the levels. When they got down to around 90 feet though, they encountered the real terror. There was a mysteriously engraved stone among the artifacts discovered, but the scariest information was saved for last. What they saw was a pit full with traps, with a tunnel running straight into the dangerous water. Do not forget to subscribe and turn on post notification to be the first to know immediately the next post is up. Everyone was wondering what could possibly have motivated the construction of such a lethal trap. The ramifications of this discovery sent shivers down their spines, casting an ominous shadow over their efforts since they seemed designed to lure unwary persons to their watery doom. However, the Oak Island crew pushed forward unfazed by the dreadful circumstances in order to find the fabled treasure. They dug down to the exact depth of 90 feet, where they found plentiful traces of silver and gold, marking a significant discovery and breakthrough in the money pit area. They may have found the original money pit or a tunnel to an adjacent treasure room, and this news has spurred curiosity about both. The globe held its collective breath as the team battled on, and the stakes were higher than ever. Both the crew and the audience were left perplexed by the mysterious discoveries made on Oak Island, but their resolve to find the truth did not waver. Generations have been attracted by the story because of the possibility of finding the wealth and the hope of uncovering the island's secrets. Oak Island's terrifying discovery ultimately put humans to the test, pushing them to the furthest edges of their curiosity and bravery. Finding the treasure was a symbol of perseverance in the face of adversity and a commitment to expanding one's horizons and expanding one's mind. The Oak Island team's relentless pursuit was a reminder that some secrets are worth giving up everything to find, despite the many unanswered questions that remain about the trap and the Oak Island. At the end of the season, everyone was feeling upbeat. The group's unwavering faith that gold lay just beneath the surface and their dogged persistence gave rise to cautious optimism on a potential discovery. Strange force and resistance discovered in space. Click on the next video to find our more 